Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of GIS Answers. Please subscribe to the channel and like the video. Today what we'll be discussing is imagery and how to make it transparent. Previously we had uh, shown how to make layers transparent. If you remember, what you do is you highlight the layer and then the appearance shows up. And what we have here is county boundaries. They are actually um, below in the order of display of the state boundaries. And the states is solid. And you know if we if we crank up that transparency of the states, you'll see that the county boundaries are shown below. Really what I should do is just drag that county boundary above and there it is above the, the uh, state boundary. But, you know, for some some cases you might want uh, things below in that order of display, um, you know, and then you can use the uh, transparency. But in a similar way, we've got the world imagery and that's above my United States state boundary. What I would like to do is maybe I want to have the world imagery plus the state boundary like with a bit of a color in the polygons. So hit on world imagery, layer, appearance, and then here's the transparency. So there you can see the colors of the state boundary, the states are coming through and you can zoom in and still still have a look at the imagery. Obviously some colors work better than others, but uh, overall overall the um, it works well, the transparency works well, that's what I'm trying to say. So again, click on your layer, whether it's uh, an image service or whether it's like an ortho photo, a TIFF, or JPEG 2000, whatever it would be, click on appearance, and then you can control through the transparency tool. Hopefully you found this video useful. If so, please subscribe to the channel and we'll see you again. Thanks.